Hi, this is how to program the Viper scooter, but also applies to other scooters. Unfortunately, it times out very quickly. How to program this um, is very simple. However, I've got to go through it very quickly because it, each setting times out after two seconds. So let's start very quickly. Hold the standby mode button. Simultaneously, mode one, LCD brightness. Miles per hour, kilometers an hour. Fixed to kilometers an hour on this scooter. Three, voltage monitoring mode. That is a bar graph. Four, LCD inactivity mode. When the LCD sleeps. Five, fixed, not used. Set to three. Six, wheel diameter, 10 inches. That is, shouldn't be changed, perfect. Used for collaboration with the Speedo. Seven, uh, number of magnets in the motor. Don't change that. Eight, uh, uh, use dob at the power, should be 100. Nine, switches LCD on and off, disables the scooter, leave alone, 10. Uh, driving mode pedal assist, leave alone, 11. Pedal assist again, leave alone, 12. Pedal assist start strength, time for pedal assist start, leave alone, 13. Pedal assist magnet, again, phase motors, leave alone, 14. Current limiting for a uh, scooter should be about 14 or 12 15 uh, BMS cut off level 15 and a half elks 16 uh, odometer setting can't change it obviously 17 crew control very useful 18 regenerative braking I'll go on to that in a second So settings 10, 11 and 12 should never been changed. They are the uh, pedal assist modes. And if you mess around with those, basically you're gonna screw the scooter up. It won't start, you won't break it, but it won't start. Um, the BMS uh, number 16 is very important because this is where the battery level cuts off when it reaches a below a certain point and it protects the battery. Uh, regenerative braking is very important and very useful but um, <laughs> set it as low as possible when you start I set it as one if you set it as three the second you release the brakes the magnetic brakes will kick in and regenerate the battery preserve it and recharge it but it really kicks in so avoid um, putting on three if possible I would suggest one or two um, Cruise control, used with absolute caution. It's fantastic if you're driving along a long highway. Um, the, the second you hit the brakes or the throttle, it will stop. And a normal sort of like uh, driving mode will resume, but used with extreme caution. Um, what else to say? Um, don't mess around with 10, 11, 12 settings because they're pedal assist and uh, anything to do with the magnetic poles and the Hall effect motor, uh, Hall effect uh, sensor is absolutely going to screw the scooter up for good. So uh, leave those at default. 10, 11, 12 should really be 223. Um, anything else? Um, let me know. Okay.